James Franklin has reeled in another top 25 recruiting class, but it wasn't easy hanging on to all these commits. Six Sports, Carrie Osip is live in our Center County newsroom this evening. Hi, Carrie. Hey, Jordan. Yeah, we did learn yesterday that they were able to take a top 25 recruiting class for 2016. And these days, recruiting can be quite challenging with the over-the-top tactics from some programs and bringing social media into it. But James Franklin believes it's a Penn State me method that helped them nab the two five-star recruits. Yeah, we want to be creative, not creepy. Um, and, you know, that's what our staff likes to do. We like to kind of have fun. We like to think outside the, back, the box. We like to have fun with recruits and their families. But to me, it's, it's more about relationships. The coaching staff taking the approach of building relationships and letting the university sell itself benefited the recruitment of top running back Miles Sanders. This is a 40-year decision, not a four-year decision. And I think when you look at it that way, Penn State is a tremendous option. Um, and I think Miles and his mom kind of understood that, you know, and, and that, was, that was the commitment and that was the reason they made the decision. Um, where what happens is at the end of the recruiting period, um, you know, it can get aggressive and it can get nasty and it can get um, relentless. The aggressive nature of recruiting proved true as offensive lineman Michael Minnett was called from a coach from another undisclosed Big Ten school, asking him to switch his commitment when Penn State lost their O-line coach, Herb Hand. Michael's response was, well, y if you want me, you better take the Penn State O-line job, you know, and to me that, that just talks about um, you know, how that family was committed to us. Franklin also believes this program is making progress to turning a top 25 recruiting class into a top 25 team during the season. Trying to make very thoughtful decisions about Penn State, about the direction we're going, and how we want to build it, and, um, and feel really good about that. The next step is when Franklin gets to decide who will have a significant role right away and who will fill in as backup, and he'll get that chance in the summer when he gets to see most of these freshmen for the first time taking the field. Live at the State College Bureau, Carrie Osep, Six Sports.